What's up everybody, day two of PAX East. I just got done playing a game without using a controller, a mouse, or a keyboard. That's right, I played Prodigy. And here to tell you a little bit about it is Megan Jenks, the community manager of the one and only Hanukkah Games. How are you doing today? I'm good, how about you? Enjoying the show? I'm, I'm loving it. What's your favorite part of PAX East so far? Uh, the people, always the people, yeah. There's a very wide array of them. Yeah. <laughs> awesome, so tell me a little bit about Prodigy. I've heard Skylanders for adults. I feel like it's not quite as deep as it goes though. No, we're way better than Skylanders for adults. Um, we are a tactical RPG. We're played with NFC miniatures and cards. So once you start the game, you actually to start the game even, you don't use a mouse or a keyboard. Uh, everything is controlled through NFC. The board is a grid of readers. So you move your character uh, characters around in position. There's a lot of strategy to where they're placed on the board. You can place them behind each other for offense and defense. Um, and uh, that's how you control the game. To perform actions like skills or special attacks or anything like that, you use cards. They also have NFC chips in them and you'll just touch the cards to the board to trigger the actions. You can do different combinations. I was wondering what kind of magic you guys are using to get it to yeah, work on the card. So just to give you guys an idea, here's what we're looking at here. I've got these awesome little figurines. They all have different names. They all have different stats. They all have different purposes. And it's really, really cool. Some of them work together. Some of them will kind of help each other out. And they, there's all sorts of stories and things that go into it. We use this little white board to make it work. You place these guys on here. And you're going to use these cards to select your actions for it. It's really neat. It's really ingenious. I really like how deep it goes. Yeah. It's not too hard to jump into, but there's a lot of complexity to it. So, how many of these guys are you planning on making? Um, we're going to launch with 17. Okay. So there'll be two full companies. There's two factions: the Company of the Thorns, the Company of the Storms, Fight for the Sorcerer Kings, and the Freaky. That's awesome. I'm loving them. Who does the design for them? Uh, it's John Bay. He uh, was formerly at Rackham. He developed Confrontation, um, very well known in the miniatures and tabletop game uh, genre. So he, that he's kind of extending that now into digital as well. Yeah, it's really, really cool. I really dig it. It's an amazing thing. Now, you guys are currently on Kickstarter, and you passed your goal. We did. We went to Kickstarter to fund our alpha and to find our alpha players, and we did. We surpassed our goal in the first three days. There's still 20 days to go, um, so it's not too late to get in. And uh, there's a lot of really cool Kickstarter exclusives. Yeah, that's awesome. It, that's impressive, too. Three days. Yeah, this well, we were very happy. So. <laughs> this is a really ambitious project. So what are you planning on doing now? Do you have any other stretch goals, anything that you're looking into? Yeah, we've actually um, introduced a couple of stretch goals already, for, we've, and we reached our first uh, already. Um, we're putting in new gameplay modes, new, um, new storyline, um, and just expanding the game and the ways to play it. I love it. Awesome. So guys, make sure to check it out on Kickstarter. Prodigy, it's a really cool game. A lot of ambition, a lot of really cool things going on here. Thank you so much for joining oh, us you. today. Thank you. I appreciate it. Uh -huh.